Pastor David uh, heard a song that I wrote years and years ago, and um, he asked me about it. I said, do you know Daddy's Girl? And I go, well, I wrote that. It was like number one in Texas and some places years ago in the 70s. And I was in San Diego, and ABC, their local affiliate, called me and said, Dennis, uh, we want you to represent uh, your belief. And I said, well, all right, can you come to our show? It'll be on uh, Friday. And so, yeah, I'll come. So I had no idea what I was in for. And so I came and I sat down. There was this real pretty girl. She had this hair that came way out to here and all the way down. And uh, uh, she kind of looked at me and like, what are you doing here? And come to find out, I was supposed to debate this lady. She was the president of the prostitute union of the city of San Diego and the city of Los Angeles. And I got, you know, how did I get talked into this thing? You know, and so, of course, the narrator starts out, and Dennis has got a belief of da-da-da and morality, and she's going, what's morality? And, and uh, I got a little angry. I, uh, you know, what is morality? Mocking God and everything. I said, well, the difference between animals and human beings are morality. And if you don't believe in morality, next time you're sick, I, I suggest you go see a veterinarian. And I was kind of, you know, I was a little young and kind of feisty and, you know, and then she came off and I was just nice. And I thought, Dennis, calm down, just quote some scriptures. And I started quoting scriptures that there's a God that, that uh, who died for you on a cross and believe it or not, you're made in his image. Women and men in Genesis 1, 27 are made in the image of God. In Galatians 3, at the end of the chapter, women and men become sons of God. In John 1, verse 12, men and women become sons of God that believe on the name. And uh, well, later on, you know, uh, I was talking and then she was talking and the crowd was there. It was kind of like the Oprah crowd, you know, kind of cheering up for her and laughing at me. But uh, anyway, I got my truck and I couldn't get out of there quicker. Well, six weeks later, I was doing a, uh, a concert in, in La Jolla. And here came this lady, and I couldn't recognize her, but she had, I know, a turtleneck up to here. She was dressed totally different. And her hair was back, and she come up to me, and she said, Dennis, I, I accepted Christ through you. And I said, really, where? On the TV show the other day. And I looked at her again her blue eyes, I go, I remember you. And she said, thank you. A letter to Christ. I quit my job. Got a lot of people mad, you know. And I never saw her after that. But I went home and wrote this song. Raised in Texas, a beautiful ranch, her daddy left home. Her mama found another man, you're on your own. No one to love, she hits to ride and went away. To a city out of the country full of shame. Money ran out, she'd met a man and lost her pride. Abused and confused, she started to cry. All the pain I've never known while well, I was daddy's girl. Away from a family in a sinful world. I want to go home. want to go home like a prodigal to be loved what I knew before take me what I am I want to go home she walked by a rescue mission and she heard a voice say to give was all I had I made a choice my life was full of shame Jesus took me all alone 
the streets no more. My love was made of stone. I want to go home to my father. I want to go home, be daddy's girl. Take me what I am. I want to go home. I want to go home to my father. I want to go home like a prodigal. To be loved what I knew before. Take me what I am. I want to go home. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so very much. And that was for you, Dave. Thank you.